After testing positive for COVID-19 and being in a medically induced coma, San Antonio nurse Justin Vine is finally home with his family. We first told you about Justin's story in August. Tonight, he talks about his road to recovery and how he's reacting to President Trump's diagnosis. The night team's Tiffany Huertas has the story. It was really nice just to uh, see some familiar, friendly, happy faces that I hadn't seen in a long time. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Justin Vine was released from the hospital on Friday. It's incredible that we can have him back and, and just spend time together. Vine was hospitalized on June 30th after testing positive for COVID-19. He was placed on a ventilator, given a plasma donation and remdesivir. After being in a medically induced coma for 56 days, Vine began to improve. He came out of the coma and went to rehab. Although he's back home, he is still using a walker and taking it one day at a time. I am on a couple medications that hopefully I can wean off of pretty soon. I take a blood pressure medication. Um, I just take some for reflux. So, and uh, it's been for pain when I have pain in my feet. Vine says he is not letting his guard down, and neither should you. There's no one who's immune to this exposure. Senators for getting it. President guy has it. His wife has it. And you, if you think if anybody wasn't going to get it, it would be them. Vine says he will continue to work on his walking and hopes to recover soon to get back to work as a pediatric nurse practitioner. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News.